A horrifying incident unfolded in Barangay Poblacion Dos as a passenger jeep, allegedly losing its brakes, plowed through pedestrians and vehicles, resulting in two fatalities, including a two-year-old child and more than 14 injuries. According to a GMA News report on Saturday, January 20th, the incident took place at 5 p.m. and CCTV footage recorded the movement of the Jeep before it collided with an e-bike and tricycle. A man carrying a monoblock chair attempted to cross the road but was struck by the approaching jeepney. He climbed onto the hood but tragically got dragged and rolled underneath. The jeepney came to a halt only after crashing into a nearby establishment, prompting passengers to quickly disembark. The victims included two-year-old Sandra Margaret Arevalo, riding an e-bike, and 45-year-old Henry Audihi, who borrowed a seat from across the street for his father's birthday celebration. Ney Carlin police reported at least 14 injuries, mostly students heading home from school. Seven vehicles were involved in the collision. The jeepney driver, Dario Dorado, surrendered to Ney Carlin police, claiming it was an accident. Police Major Paul Raymond Ayon, head of Nate Carlin Police, revealed that the driver realized he lost his brakes when a passenger alighted. Additionally, the road was on a decline, causing the jeep to continue moving. Kung sakali po, same incident na wala ng preno, piliin po natin yung lugar na banggain po natin na malilis po yung injuries. Dorado apologized to the victims and their families. He now faces charges of reckless imprudence resulting in double homicide, multiple injuries, and damage to properties. 